Hello and welcome to Dr. Legenskov, the Tiger, and the Terribly Cursed Emerald, a Whirlwind Heist. Today's video isn't going to be the Stanley Parable. I am working on a video for the Stanley Parable right now, trying to make it come out tomorrow. Um, but it's taking, it's taken a little bit longer to record that one and to edit it all together because of how many endings are going to be in that one. So you can expect that hopefully tomorrow I can get it finished. But today we're going to be playing this game because it's also made by Crow Crow Crows, which is the, um, they're the original creators of the Stanley Parable and they're the ones that remastered it. And this is also another very entertaining game that is very similar to the Stanley Parable. It doesn't have multiple endings, but it's very entertaining. And you guys will kind of get it more when we just start it up. But uh, yeah, let's just jump straight into it. Positions, please. I can't crouch. Performance 237, beginning in 3, 2, 1. Oh, whoa. Let's go. Of resignation. I didn't quit when the flood happened. I didn't quit when you reassigned me to a spectacularly dangerous department with no training. I didn't quit when the forklift broke and dropped a set piece on my ankle. But looking at all those things written down, I'm beginning to realize that I probably sh I'm not generally in favor of industrial action, but thinking about it when the brand new health and safety department literally catches fire within days of being established, perhaps just, perhaps, something like this is necessary. <laughs> Santiago Morris, heavy goods transportation. Formerly paint shop. This is kind of cool. A lot, like, more interactive. One second, please. Hold hold your first position. There's somebody at the door. Uh, yeah, I know. Okay, one second. Can we get a professional paper on the chair, please? There's two of them. Right. Okay. Hi. So, this is... This is... So, this is a bit... Um, this is a bit awkward. I think it's probably best if we're just really honest with each other. It's... Uh, it, yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit awkward. Um... The thing is, the game you've just downloaded, somebody is playing it right now, so you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't play it. I'm, I'm really sorry. Yeah, this is, uh, yeah, this is quite inconvenient. I don't know, I don't know why this keeps happening. Sorry, we're generally quite organised. You should come inside, I'll explain. Uh, just through here. It's, it's perfectly safe. I mean, it's most, here's the thing. The game's live, which makes it impossible to to insert you, and also it's 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 just quite difficult now for you to leave. But I think it's okay. I I I know I, I know what to do. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try and call publicity and liaisons, and we should be able to take you to the green room. All right. If you just wait here, uh, and yeah, we'll be able to get you in. All right. Let me just let me just find the number here. Okay. It's ringing. Somebody will pick up. We're okay. Oh, they hung up. Okay, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try that again. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Uh, okay, let's see. Da, 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 da. I'm sorry, I know, I know we've both got better things to be doing with our lives. Oh, come on, come on. 
Okay. Oh, I know what's going on. We've got um, something of a strike sort of situation emerging. Yeah, we've b we've become quite understaffed. Actually, you wouldn't um, mind doing me a favour, would you? Come come through here. I could really I could I could really use your help. But if you'd rather if you'd rather wait here, I I could just let you know when we're ready for you. It's it's just you know why miss out on this opportunity, right? The thing is, our entire weather department and half the wildlife crew is just up to left before we could even begin this morning. And it's all super simple. It's mostly buttons. You like buttons, right? And you'll be able to play the game as soon as whoever is in there at the moment is finished. Promise. Your help? Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, this way. Yeah, the lighting department's right through here. I want to mm. explore some of this stuff. So much yeah. detail. Could we, could we maybe move it along just a little? The play has been in the loading screen for the last minute and a half, and we really should bring up the lights. I like look away it down. Oh no, that's where the game is. Oh. Uh, yep, that's the broom. Didn't think that would actually. Ah, no, that's uh, that's miscellaneous interactions. We don't need to go in there. Could you get off the table? We've got a lot to get be getting on with. It's not a very stable table. Please get off. Come on, get off the table, please. What? Because what? it's dirty as well. It's very dirty. People eat off that table. Could you maybe 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 not stand on the table? Thank you. Uh, right, yeah. Could could you um, could you maybe get off the table? It's just there's all sorts of papers and look. Why why are you on the table? Oh, that was an adventure. Okay, so if you could just head down the stairs there, yeah. We have a job to do. Plenty of other tables for you this way. Oh, up, up again, huh? Okay, I'm done with the table now. Right, first things first, could you bring up the lights? Oh my god, that switch literally says unknown, and you thought it'd be a good idea to flick it? Who oh. knows what it does? I don't even know if we should be concerned. I still need you to pull the lighting lever though. That, that would be ideal. Yeah, just now. It's the bigger one. There it goes. Little lights blinking on in the windows of the mansion, up past the ornamental ponds. Oh, it's pretty magical, really. Okay, now we need to attack them with a the tiger. It, it, it's a heist game. The player's playing a big heist. I, I don't want to spoil it for you, but it, the tiger's very important. It's in the title. All right. Into wildlife preparation. Just through the door. Don't, you don't have to be alarmed. It's not. It's not a real jungle. It's just a game. It's actually. It's just a room full of bits of jungle. The difference is important. But I. I mean, I, I can understand the concern. Ugh! You don't even know what secondary interruptive means, do you? I mean, neither do I. But you're the one who pressed it. Look. Um. Poor switch choices aside, we really need to keep going now. There's a sort of a... There's some unique time pressure in the next room. The lighting department spent at least an afternoon on that. They'd be really unhappy... I can't let you in there. Sorry. It's, it's very complicated. Health and safety. It's shelves. It's just... There's a lot of shelves. But look, we really need to attack the player with the tiger. It's very important. Knuckle zone. Right, this is all. It's so safe. We'd usually have someone else do this, but they started striking right after one of them got. Well, that's not. Well, I, 
question no. Just, just pull the lever and, and let's say introduce the tiger to the left. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. You really shouldn't do that. Because the tiger won't be able to get out of range. I don't I don't well, I, I mean I wouldn't bet on it. Or just as offy. No, no. Okay, it's cool. They, they press the button to release. Stand down. You need to actually release the tiger before the recovery crew can do anything. You know. Oh no! Oh no! Not that! Not that door. There's a look. There's a far more pressing concern in the room, and it's growling. There's an actual tiger in this room. An actual tiger, but it's about four feet away from you. Don't, I don't want to cause alarm, but it's a tiger. Okay, look. Here's what I'll tell you. This tiger, this tiger alone, has eaten at least seven human hands. Probably more. Almost definitely more. Perfect. That went perfectly. Look, the tiger's inside the level. We need to make sure it doesn't, you know, eat everybody. Could you hit the red button to send the retrieval team? It's the it's the button. I think it's by the door to the weather room. We just can't leave the tiger in the level. We try that one. I hate all the birds. And then the head of the little statue on the fountain. And then and then Trevor. Look, just please press the button. Oh, they actually meant to do it this time. The tiger's out in the level. Okay, go. They're on the move. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to work out where you're going to be most useful. I don't think we have anybody left in catwalks, do we? Oh, we do. Oh, great. Wow. Can't believe it. I guess weather control then. The door's just over there. You're doing, you're doing so great. There's not really, there's really not far to go. The bird. Oh, I hate this room. It hasn't been easy, you know. During a second performance, a pipe burst in here and flooded the whole garden level. I got stuck on the. Uh, on the roof of the summer house. All right, okay, the script calls for a storm. Let's make it rain. It's the red valve on the pipe next to the door. Gently. A lot of the story relies on there being a storm. It's, 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 a, it's a big part of act three. No, 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 too much. Okay, we're good. Uh, there's a button below the fan that sorts out the thunder and lightning. Could you do the lightning? It's a really nice effect. It really is. Oh! It might be wired up wrong. I'm sorry. That room gets quite damp. Now I think about it, it might have been safe. Oh no! There it is! There it goes! You've got a picture of the building lit up by these big flashes of lightning. It's really imposing. The set's massive. Oh! Speaking of, the player has apparently entered the mansion through the orangery and is. They're gonna use the lift. Okay, that's not kind of visible. Right here. This way. Actually, wait, hang on a second. This is really important. Behind this door is the closest the player ever passes backstage. They'll be right behind a wall. And I don't know what the wall's made of, but I do know that it's phenomenally cheap. So it's gonna have to be very quiet. Okay. down the steps. Yeah, that's good. That's the mansion in there. I didn't want to tell you, but we actually lost the player for a minute earlier. I mean, I mean, they're back now. It's fine. We're good. But they, they completely vanished for a bit. Which, thinking about it, might be a fairly good argument for not pressing the switch. Marked unknown. In any case, here's what we need to do. The player's going to come down the corridor and call the lift. And once the doors open and they get inside, they're going to press the down button. When that happens, all you have to do is pull the lever on this side. This lift was always supposed to power itself, obviously. This is just a hangover from rehearsals that nobody got round to replacing. 
Besides, it's fine, it's fine. We've got plenty of time. And actually, no, wait, here he comes, here he comes. Shh, out, ice front, ice front, ice front. Wait for him. Ready? What are they doing? Why haven't they, why haven't they pressed the button? Do they hear us? Don't move. Pull the, pull the lever. Pull the lever now, please. What are you waiting for? Pull it. <sighs> You're breaking my heart. Okay, 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 fine. We'll just wait. We'll just wait, shall we? Oh, thank God. Oh, no idea what happened there. I think, I think, I think they, they can't have heard us. I hope they didn't hear us. They probably didn't hear us. At least they're on their way now. Actually, they're going to be very busy with the vault. You could start playing in the grounds. We just need to prep some pyrotechnics for the escape sequence and then you're good to go. There's a lift to the pyro workshop up the stairs. Coins. Could we just uh, hurry along? So many coins. You're not into lifts. That's okay, I can understand that. But we really should keep moving. It's not, it's not an unpleasant lift. Really, it's a, it's a good lift. Oh my god. Are you okay? Do you, do you do you still have your ankles? Are they are they in the correct uh, orientation? Okay, you're okay? You do? That's great. I'm so I'm oh god, I'm so sorry about that. I really This is well, this is the weather room, isn't it? Uh right. Okay, listen. Since we can't reach the lift of Pyro, the only way back into the game is through is through a department called High Concept Miscellaneous Interactions. I didn't want to have to do this to you. There's usually a lot of training involved. But I'll talk you through it. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. You... Brace yourself. Welcome to Miscellaneous Interactions. This is the department that controls... Well, it controls a lot of things. Locked and unlocked doors, interior lights, smoke machines, telephone calls, actor cues, laser lights, vault guards, tranquilizer dart strengths, you know, that kind of thing. But it's all just done with numbers. I, I don't know why. And, uh, and usually the operators have got this big, um, you know, usually they know what they're doing. But I've got a manual here. I think we'll get through it. All right, in order to get started, you're going to want to press the number four. Just go right ahead, the number four. It should be on the left hand side. Uh, you know, you know, you know the number four, right? It's a, you know, four. It's uh it's like a it's like an L shape. Oh god, no, no, that wasn't four! That was like the opposite of four. Uh, yeah, I, uh, yeah. I don't think that light's a, a bad sign. Uh, five, seven, two, one, two, one. Um, three. Ah. Okay. So what we did there, it turns out, was the wrong thing. Because you, um, because you press nine and then four and then and then. Did we? Oh, I think we restarted. It. It's all right. There's a page in the manual. What? What? What did you just... That could have been very important! What did you... Why did you... Ah! I, it's alright. Okay. I found the right instructions. Alright, I need you to press the number 9. No! No, no, not that. Alright. Let's... Okay, well let's, let's just assume that we've got 9 sorted. Right? Okay. 5, 2, 1, 4, 4. Wait! No! Hit start to cancel that. And then a 2. Six, just ignore that. That's fine. Right. Seven, two, left. One, four, two. Oh, Christ. Please pick up the phone.
phone. Please, and talk to them this time. How can you, how can you, how is this not making you incredibly anxious? Pick up the phone. Please pick up the phone. Please pick up the phone. Oh, come on. Again? Is, is there, do you just not know how to use the phone? All right, back to the board. Hit these four numbers. Two, five, nine. Oh, I guess we don't need to bother with nine. Oh. That sound that I might have told you to ignore, it turns out that it's, that's a very bad alarm. So I'm going to need you to just do a 180, right down the stairs, please, right down. Probably, I'd probably go a bit further. Move! You really, you really want to move right now. I'm sorry I didn't know about the alarm, but there's been a lot going on. Here's, here's good, here's good, great. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Okay, back, back, come on, back up the stairs. A bit faster than that, please. Just a bit, you know, just a bit faster. Come on, come on. No, 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 please stick with me. We've got to, we've really got to fix this. All right, don't worry, don't worry. Actually, do worry a bit. Hit seven, four, then asterisk. Is there a fire below us right now? Is there, some, is there something on fire? Oh, there is, isn't there? I don't think, really, I don't think any of this room is supposed to be on fire. Please don't do what I think you're about to do. Please don't do it. Pick up the phone and, and put it to your ear. Like a normal person. Like a normal person who can answer a phone. No! <laughs> <laughs> you did mine, you didn't do. Why did you do it anyway? Why? Wait, hang on. We can we can still fix this. We can. I I need you to find a blue panel marked downpour. Turned off, right? I found a way to activate the failsafe lever to the left of the key. Oh no, wait, on the right of the keypad. Right, not left. Don't do the left. Uh, okay, when the downpour panel lights up, I'm gonna need you to pull it. When it lights up, not before. Any moment now. Did we do it? I think we did it. The players left the mansion. I think, I think we did it. I don't think it's supposed to still be raining, but you know. Hey, come back down the stairs. You're, you're done here. You don't need to spend any more time in this room. You can forget about the whole thing. This is it. You're done, sister. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You really helped out. We couldn't have made it through without you. We really couldn't have. Through here. Here we are again. So this is how it's going to work. You go in there. Just give me a moment. I will bring the lights up. And Dr. Langenkopf, the tiger, and the terribly cursed emerald. Enjoy it. Oh, don't tell me you're getting cold feet now. Anything. Trust me, anything on the other side of that door is peanuts compared to what we've just gone through. It's great, though. It's, uh, it's really good. Particularly the voice work. Some of the voice work is outstanding. It's really good. I can see Basta sniffing all over this. It's really good. It'll probably win awards. Thank you so much. Another player? You've got to be kidding me. You've, I can't, I can't do this again. Okay, this is really awkward. The fact of the matter is, wait, hang on, where are you going? Right, so look, I need to talk you. Okay, that's the lighting room. You need to talk. Okay, fine, this is wildlife prep. No, hang on, this is, that, that's a, hang on, there's a tiger in there. There's a tiger in there. That's, uh, no, don't, don't pull that. Wait, no, oh. oh God.
has been Dr. Lubenskov's terrible whirlwind heist. Or the terrible emerald whirlwind heist. It is such a long title. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It's more unique, but that that's the entire game. Um, hopefully you enjoyed it though. I will be back with more Stanley Parable, hopefully tomorrow. I'm going to be doing all of the bucket endings. So there's quite a lot of endings put in there, but I did some tips. Well, not some tips. I did some tricks <laughs> to make it um less jarring for you guys. So hopefully it'll be enjoyable. But yeah, I'll see you tomorrow in the Stanley Parable, all the bucket endings. But I hope you enjoyed today's little weekly intermediate break video. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you in the next one.